Well, I thought that it was the ammunition causing the blown primers in that PSL. So I opened up a new case of ammo, it was Russian, and I took it out within around 10 rounds or so, something like that. I had a blown primer out of that. And uh, the, the reason I thought it was ammo is because if you see these primers that are blown out, the, uh, the primer's been pushed all the way up level with the bottom of the case. Usually, let's see if this will focus. Usually they're, they're like that where it's, the, the primer is recessed. Come on, phone. Well, anyway, the primer is recessed down in the pocket. And with all these, it's been like swaged up against the breech face. I was like, well, there must be that Romanian ammo. There must be some hot rounds in that last little few packs that I have. But, same thing happened with this Russian. I noticed every time, it must be just the way the blown primers are. It's not over pressure rounds, but for some reason it makes it kind of flatten out. So here's how they usually are. The ones that don't blow out. See, but all of them are cratered. And so, anyway, it's not it's not the ammunition. So, I, I got the bolt. And here's my old bolt. And here's the new one. Uh, let me find the fire in. Well, it just does not like trying to focus right here. Well, maybe it's where the light is. But it just looks blurry to me. There it is. You can see how far that sticks out. It's quite a ways. And I'll put the other. Now that that's what the the pin that goes to that bolt. And then I've got the pin. For the other bolt, look at that. It doesn't stick out that far. It must be that firing pin. It just sticks out so far now. I don't know what's happened. Like I said, I've fired this with this pin and this bolt yeah, at least a thousand times. Probably way more. And no problems. This didn't happen until just recently. So, maybe it's from dry firing it. I don't dry fire it much, but it does happen by accident if I don't count the rounds. Like I said, my, mine was built out of a parts kit. It's a mismatched parts kit. And uh, it doesn't have the bolt hold open. But I think that's the problem. So, I'm going to put the, the old firing pin and the new bolt. And go from there this bolt also has some other problems it this has a real loose head space i don't have head space gauges but i think this bolt's way out of spec you could put a live round in it and you could just wiggle it and it still moves back and forth a lot it looks like it's only holding on one lug but i guess whoever built this rifle for century and it was one of the early psls back when they were Getting real Romanian ones that they did build a small number out of parts kits. With the, it has the original barrel. It's just made on an American receiver. But I, I think that's probably going to solve the problem.